All right. Week nine, let's go. Could one, like, is Reddit a thing where you post clips? If so, if whoever clipped that could post it over there. Or somewhere. In a Madden forum. Because that's absurd. Freaking green screen. Stop. Stop playing a ruined. Alright, so the Cowboys. Actually... The same overall team as us. I think this is the first time we've seen a roster as good as ours is. Might be an issue. We'll see. We will see. Let's see. That block, though. Unreal. Let's see. What happened, K. Watts? I missed something. What did I miss? It's on all Madden, White Mike. Weird. Move this a little bit. Prime time game against the Cowboys. Once one of the great rivalries in the NFL. Thanks, Bama. All right. After that last game. Oh, my goodness. Wow. All right, I'm interested to see what their lineup is, though. Because, again, they have the same overall team as us. They let Dak Prescott go in free agency. Monster Red Boo. Thank you for that follow, man. Welcome to Sneaky Nation, dude. How you doing today? Malcolm Thomason. 82 overall. Same as Hudson Bonani. They also have Johnny Manziel as a backup. Then Blair Babin. Running back Joe Payne. They are missing Ezekiel Elliott. To injury. They're also missing their backup, Percy Shazier. That's a huge blow to their team. Going to be interesting to see how they respond. Babber at fullback. Wide receiver, Des Bryant, Tajay Sharp, and Terrence Williams. And they signed Ono Gaten back. Ono Gaten had a killer rookie season for the Cowboys. But he was a late pick or an undrafted free agent. He didn't resign with them. We ended up picking Ono Gaten up last year, but he didn't do much of anything for us. He has signed back with the Cowboys. Wow. They also have Moten, who's a rookie. They have a freaking killer. They also have Deshaun McClung here. They have a killer wide receiver group. Tight end Zachary Otto, 86 overall. Left tackle, Boyle, 87. Left guard, Zach Martin, 99. Frederick, 95. Carlisle, 72. Rubber City with the host. Can we get some love in the chat for Rubber? And can we get a shout-out for him as well? If one of the mods could post this link, Sneaky Nation, go show Rubber some love. Will Hoyt at right tackle, not a good offensive line for them. Demarcus Lawrence, 85 overall. Well, the left side in the center is good. The right side's terrible. Randy Gregory, right end. Defensive tackle, Crawford and Robison. Normando Bowler, 83 overall. Left outside linebacker. How you doing today, Rubber? It's good to see you, man. Middle linebacker, Jalen Smith and Pullard. Right outside linebacker, Marcus McLaughlin. Cornerback, Anthony Brown. Cape, I mean... Not a good corner group here. They are missing Denard out with injury as well. Free safety, Byron Jones, 87 overall. Strong safety, J.J. Wilcox. So there are holes on the defense. The injury to Ezekiel Elliott hurts, but they also have a killer receiving group. Going to be an interesting battle here. We are at home. Here we go. Rubber, what's going on, man? Can one of the mods post Rubber's link, guys? Sneaky Nation, you need to go check out Rubber City Bikers Fun. Awesome streamer. Good friend of the channel. Thank you so much, Bama. 
Go hit that follow button. Show him some love. All right. Nerdy, thank you for the host. 19 touchdowns, 12 interceptions for Thomason on the season. All right. So he's throwing a lot of touchdowns, but he's turning the ball over at a high rate, kind of like Hudson Bonani is. Ooh, Buckner with the flag early on to get things going. Not a great start. That's not a penalty you see this team make a whole lot here. Where all can I post that clip? Because that is one of the greatest Madden things I have seen. Unreal. What up, King? First down and five. Payne on the outside, filling in for Ezekiel Elliott. A good run. A gain of about 10 yards before Demarcus Avery got there. Storm, thank you for the host. Appreciate you, man. All right. First down and 10. Thomason, another sunshine quarterback. Sydney in motion. It's going to be another handoff to Payne here. Taken down by Marcus Gesser after a gain of a few. They're all sunshines, probably. Second down and nine. Thomason looking to throw under pressure. He's going to throw this one away. That'll bring up a third down and nine for the Cowboys. Zeke would have hurdled. <laughs> oh, man. Third and nine. Shotgun formation. Two in the backfield. They put DeForest Buckner one-on-one. -on -one. Pressure coming on the quarterback from Armstead. And Thomason barely getting the ball out of his hands there. 49ers will take over. Fourth and nine, Jones to pump the ball away to Marcus Avery, eyeing another block after his game-winning touchdown in overtime just a week ago. Almost getting another one there, coming up just shy. And that pump will go out of the back of the end zone. 49ers offense onto the field for the first time today. 13 touchdowns, 12 interceptions for Hudson Bonani this season. So not as many touchdowns as Thomason on the other side, but having a good season up until last week when he threw five interceptions. He's back on the field today. The 49ers do have faith in him, but um, might have a shorter tolerance for him making mistakes now, especially after the game that Asher McClover had, but a good start with a 27-yard reception. To, uh, to Cleveland there, Darion Cleveland. First down and 10. Another dump off to Cleveland, and he's making it work for him all the way down to the 42 of Cowboys territory, picking up another first down, Hudson Bonani. Finding his favorite target there. Well, him and Cherry both. First and 10. Hand off to Marion up the middle. That'll be good for a gain of three. Second down and seven. Five thousand swag. On the right side, Cleveland picking up the first down, fighting off a tackle down to the 29-yard line. No, we've done long routes with Cleveland, too. They're just not covering that at the moment. Dimitri Todman is back for the 49ers. Going to dump it to Fryer there. He'll take it down to the 20-yard line. Second down in inches. I forgot to change the playbook again, dang it. I keep forgetting. Hand off to Kirkland Marion up the middle. He'll pick up the first down. All right. First and 10. Gosh, this team has so many weapons when Todman is healthy. It's going to be Parrish Mooney on the right side, holding on to the ball down to the seven. 
first down and goal from the seven yard line. It's going to be a handoff to Kirkland. Marion finding the hole in the defense down to the one yard line. Watch Dimitri Todman die in this game. Gosh, is it bad that I just would be like, eh, that makes sense. It's like the first time in Madden history a player has died on the field. Second down and goal. There is Carlos Hyde into the end zone. Touchdown for the 49ers. Kirkland Marion gets the yards. Carlos Hyde gets the touchdown. And the 49ers will strike first. Great drive led by Hudson Bonani. Joel Edison will kick a field goal through the uprights here. And the Cowboys will come back out onto the field after the kickoff. Do we have any new people into the stream tonight? If so, welcome. Hope you guys are having a good night. Moten on the return up past the 15. The 20 breaking a tackle. And still fighting through tackles. Taking it to the 25-yard line. I think it's great that the Cowboys signed Ono Gaten back. Somebody always makes the joke. It's usually like 10 people that make the joke. <laughs> what up, Likata and Hobo? Hobo's over there lurking. How you doing tonight, man? Shotgun formation, play action. Thomason scanning the field under pressure. And he is... How is that not a penalty or a fumble or something? I don't know. He threw the ball backwards to nobody. And yet it's perfectly okay. He, he gets the Drew Brees calls, I guess. Second down and 10. Well, welcome, Monster. Pressure coming. Thomason down the field again. Just going to throw it away. He's starting off this game 0-4. 49ers defense doing an excellent job keeping him at bay. All right. Those dreads. I think it's just long hair, just not the best graphics. Thomason play action. Under pressure, going to find Des Bryant on the play, beating the zone coverage down to the 39-yard line, but an injury on the play. It's Navarro Bowman, I think. A 36-yard reception there by Des Bryant. And Bowman is dinged up. 49ers no longer have Zach Brown, so depth is a little bit more sketchy. They have a late round pick at middle linebacker to fill in. We'll see how he does. 49ers also have John Forsey, who they do feel comfortable with. Shotgun formation, handoff to Payne on the left side. A gain of about five there. Be second and five from the 34-yard line. What up, Mike? How you doing today? A Bruce Sternum. I have never freaking seen this injury until this season. And like every three plays, one of our guys goes down with a Bruce Sternum now. I don't know. Dislocated hip, I bet. It's nothing serious. We'll have him back next game. We can deal with him uh, without him for a game. Payne, not much there. John Forsey on the stop. It'll be third down and five for the Cowboys. 49ers going zone here. Shotgun formation. Payne in the backfield. Looking to throw it. Time to work with on the right side. Wide open is Williams, but he's going to drop the pass. A rare drop there. And the Cowboys going to have to settle for a long field goal. About 51 yards here. And it will be right through the upright. 7-3 is the score about nine minutes into the first quarter here. Bailey kicking off. Sellers. What is that ref doing? Like, how is that even okay? <laughs> like, look at this ref here. Look at it, like... And BYD says refs aren't paid off. If this is not trying to... What in the world? He's vanished on the replay. Oh, I know where you were though, ref. Look at the... Look, the NFL has edited the ref out of the replay so the 49ers cannot file a grievance. Not okay with this. Not okay with this. 
Codes. My goodness. First down and 10 from the 25-yard line. There's all the proof you need, BYD. Hand off to Kirkland Marion. Following his block there, taking it up to the 32 for a 7-yard pickup. Ref gate. Second down and three. Hand off to Kirkland Marion again. He might be shy here. That's McLaughlin on the tackle. Third and one. Forty Niners looking to get this first down. Cowboys, not a lot of people on the line here. Going to be a handoff. Kirkland Marion following his block got tripped up on Edmonds there. But good enough for the first down. That could have gone for a bit more. All right. And there's Dimitri Todman, his second catch of the season. He got injured on his first catch. This is his first week back. And there he is with a big play down to the 33-yard line. First down and 10. Kirkland Marion in the backfield. Going to be a handoff to Marion. And he fumbles the ball. The Cowboys have recovered. Randy Gregory will pick it up. And a turnover for the 49ers. Not what they wanted there. Not what they wanted there. Cowboys will take over. First down and 10. 49ers, no strangers to turning the ball over. Their defense usually has the offenses back, though, and does not let the other team convert. But this time, Payne with a nice run on the right side. He'll take it to the 33, a pickup of seven. It'll be second down and three for the Cowboys. What happened, K. Watts? Did you lose the bank heist or something? Pitch to Payne. And Chantrell Wilkerson in on the stop. Tajay Beal there as well. Going to be third down and three. Did Bama lose on the bot? Oh, man. Third and three. Now shotgun formation. Nobody in the backfield. Thomason looking to throw. Pressure coming on the right side. Oh, no. Gaten, the former 49er, breaking tackles there. He'll take it to the 46-yard line. Again, Ono Gaten, a killer rookie season with the Cowboys, did not resign. Picked up by the 49ers, but just didn't really perform for them. Back with the Cowboys and looking at home again. It'll be first down and 10 once again. Shotgun formation. Thompson going to find Tajay Sharp this time. Down to the 47 of 49er territory. A seven-yard pickup. It'll be second down and three. I won the ploobs. Second down and three. Two in the backfield here. Going to be a pl uh, play action rollout to Babber, the fullback. He'll take it all the way to the 35. And the Cowboys are on the move. First quarter winding out here, though. And we will be going to the second. First down and 10. And a screenplay to Des Bryant down the left side of the field all the way to the 18-yard line. And Malcolm Thomason starting to get into rhythm now. Des Bryant over 750 receiving yards on the season. First down and 10. 49ers sending a blitz here. And it is going right at Thomason. That's a sack. Blackshear. The rookie strong safety, used mostly as a depth rotational player, is going to get the sack there. That'll be second down and 19. Good showing, though, by Blackshear. Nice to see him step up and make a play. Second and 19, Payne in the backfield here. They're going to hand it off to Payne, trying to get a few yards back. Chantrell Wilkerson there on the stop. It'll be third and long for the Cowboys. 
Third and 16. 49ers not the best team in these situations, though. They give up a lot of big plays on third and long. Thomason, though, under pressure. He will throw this one away, looking for Williams in the end zone there. It will fall incomplete, and the Cowboys looking at another field goal. Dan Bailey out onto the field. Um, we might do that, Nerdy. We might do a contest, whoever has the most hours watched in June. I need to get another bot to be able to do that, though, because I don't want to consistently reset the hours. That was something that I just couldn't control, unfortunately, with our old bot. And here comes the kick. 7-6 to six is the score early on in the second quarter. Burton on the return. Burton Guster. Ha! <laughs> if anybody gets that reference. If not, I'll, you know, just shut up now. All right. First down and 10 after the 21-yard return. On the right side, Kirkland Marion going out of bounds there. No catch. First incomplete pass of the day for Hudson Bonani. Again, Bonani, terrible week last week, throwing five interceptions. 49ers somehow survived to pick up the win, but it was actually Asher McClover in the game leading them down the field. This time, Cleveland with the catch. That will be good for a gain of about eight yards. It'll be third down and two for the 49ers. It is a reference from Psych. Josh's gaming gets it. I like it. Third down and two. Hand off to Kirkland Marion, and he will pick up the first down. A gain of maybe six on the play. Cowboys were ready for the run. Kirkland Marion just finding the hole there. First down and ten from the 42. Um, let's see what defense they have on Cherry here. Pressure coming, going to Cherry deep. And he is unable to come down with it. Excellent coverage there. Again, Cowboys don't have the best cornerbacks, but they stayed with Cherry on that play. Psych is a great show. I miss it. Second down and 10. And Cleveland with the catch. Nothing really there, though. Maybe three yards. Be third down and seven. Cowboys were ready for it. Want to be? He had a one-handed catch not that long ago. A few games ago, he had a really good one-handed catch. Over the middle, and oh, how is that not pass interference? I swear, I feel like they pulled Cleveland back there. I want to look at that. Something happened with him running. I don't know what it was, but something happened. Like right there. Look, his arm. I don't know. I don't know. Fourth and seven. All right. Sharp on the punt. Bit too far this time. First and ten for the Cowboys. Back out on the field. Shotgun formation for Thomason. Going to be a handoff to Payne. And he is taken down. Pick up a four, though. Falling forward there. Still gaining some yards. Second down and six for the Cowboys. And looking to throw is Thomason under pressure. The blitz has come and dumps it off to Williams there. And a big hit by DeMarcus Avery, but Williams doing enough to pick up the first down. Going to be first and 10 at the 31-yard line. Going to have three wide receivers out as well as Zachary Otto at tight end. Payne in the backfield, shotgun formation. Thomason looking to throw. Buckner getting pressure, and he will throw it away. It'll be second down and 10 for the Cowboys. You know what show I've been watching a lot again? Uh, Wicked Tuna. Really freaking good show. Shotgun formation for Sunshine. Thomason looking to throw. They double team 
Buckner wisely. They are starting to learn. Buckner's starting to see more double teams. Uh, about a nine-yard reception there, though. It'll be third down and one. Des Bryant getting the catch. Don't die out on me, chat. I only see Jamie, Josh, and Nerdy talking. Oh, I picked the wrong play. Oh, good catch there. Good catch by Tajay Sharp. Picking up the first down to the 46. What did Nerdy do? Arbalist going big on a bank heist. Two in the backfield. Going to be a handoff to Payne. DeForest Buckner there on the stop with Strickland. Dak Prescott left in free agency. No worries, Craig. No worries, White Mike. Feel free to lurk away. Nothing wrong with lurking. Just want to see if anybody's still in chat. <laughs> Payne going down there. John Forsey on the stop. Going to be third down and five for the Cowboys. 49ers defense hoping to come up with a stop here. Going to be sending a blitz. And Thomason once again getting away quickly. Zachary Otto down the field to the 25-yard line. The reliable tight end who took over for Jason Witten with a killer play. Zachary Otto doing a great job of reading the blitzes and getting rid of the ball quickly. 49ers not doing a great job of being able to get pressure on him yet. It'll be first and 10, Terrence Williams in motion. It's going to be a delayed handoff to Payne. He is taken down at the 22-yard line. Yeah, Otto is pretty fast. Second down and six, shotgun formation. Going to be a handoff to Vernon this time. Forcey with the hit, but an eight-yard gain by Vernon. Both running backs doing a pretty solid job filling in for Ezekiel Elliott. It'll be first down and 10 from the 14-yard line. Cowboys looking to take the lead. Pressure coming on the screen play. Payne with the reception thrown to the ground by Sean Kendall. Very difficult for a running back to get away from Kendall there. Nobody picked him up. And he'll get an easy stop on the play. Second down and five. What up, Aaron? Who I think will win the finals? The Warriors. Second down and five. Hand off to Vernon on the right side. And a big tackle by Strickland. That is the rookie. Middle linebacker, if I am not mistaken, who is only playing because of the injury to Navarro Bowman. Going to be third down and two. Calling off the blitz. We're going. We're going zone coverage here. Des Bryant in motion. Thomason a quick throw to Bryant, and that is good for a Cowboys touchdown. Des Bryant having himself a good game. And again, it's tough to get the pressure on Thomason when he's throwing the ball that quickly, hiking it, throwing it immediately, and a touchdown for the Cowboys. 12-7, it'll be 13-7 with a Dan Bailey extra point. And the Cowboys out in front over the 49ers for the first time today. What up, Mick? How you doing, man? Ever play versus the Vikings? Oh, as the Vikings? I have not as the Vikings, no. First and 10 from the 27. Hand off to Kirkland Marion. Fighting through some tackles on his way to the 34-yard line. Kirkland Marion really struggled a lot the last two weeks until overtime of last week. He had a really solid outing then. Really, Jamie? I like the Vikings uniforms. Two-minute warning. Second down and three. Oh, Fryer. Unable to hold on to the ball there. Third down and three.
Uh, no, not in a party. On the right side, it's going to be Siante Cherry avoiding the tackle down to the 10, the 5, and into the end zone. Touchdown for the 49ers, Siante Cherry, the rookie, getting the score with 1.47 to go and an opportunity to put the 49ers back out in front. But 49ers two-minute drill defense is going to get blocked. Wilcox will pick it up. They will down him. He will not return it. But we have a tie game. The struggles continuing for Joel Edison. Unreal. Unreal. 49ers two-minute drill defense. Not very good. Cowboys going to have an opportunity here. Plenty of time to go. All three timeouts still. We'll see if they can get down the field. Can I invite you to a party? I'm antisocial, bro. I don't really like parties, man. I stand in the corner and cry the whole time. I'm sorry. First down and 10. Shotgun formation. Nobody in the backfield here. We'll switch it to man defense. Double teaming Buckner. Pressure coming. He will throw this one away. Second down and 10. For the Cowboys. Marcel Cody getting pressure on him. He will throw it away once again. It'll be third down and 10. I, boy, I kind of want to send the blitz, but at the same time, this guy throws it so quickly. Blitzes just haven't worked. Third down and 10. For the Cowboys. Payne in the backfield. They will hand it off to Payne. It doesn't matter. He picks up the first. 49ers defense giving up a big run there. Cannot catch a break on those third and long situations. Thomason looking to throw. Pressure coming. He fumbles the ball. It is picked up by Strickland. The rookie middle linebacker filling in for the injured Navarro Bowman will come up with it. And they will get the ball at the 25-yard line with a minute 20 to go. Who is that? That's Tajay Veal getting the sack, forcing the fumble. Is this one going to be challenging over? No, that's a fumble. That's a clear-as-day fumble. 49ers getting the ball back. And again, our defense hasn't forced a whole lot of turnovers um, this season. Pre uh, flag down. Cherry. Holding onto the ball in traffic. That was excellent coverage. I don't think it's going to matter. That might be a holding call. It will be coming back 10 yards. Dustin Morton, the rookie center. The guilty party on the play. First and 20. Dimitri Todman getting caught up on his own guy. He'll get the catch, break the tackle. And take it down to the 20-yard line. A 15-yard gain for the 49ers. It'll be second down and five from the 20. A minute to go before halftime here. On the right side, Cherry with the catch. A penalty is down. Is that another holding call? Because he was, like, already on the ground. Oh, they're getting a face mask on it. All right. Now, if I accept that, it still counts as a catch for Cherry, doesn't it? First and goal from the seven. Throwing it into the red zone is a tricky thing. What's this middle linebacker going to do? Don't like it. Don't like it. Throwing it on the left side, Dimitri Todman drops the ball. At the seven there. Wide receiver screen here is probably not a great idea. But if he gets a good block, it might work. It's also a dangerous throw. I think he's got it. Nope, he didn't get one block. They got the first block. I hesitated a bit long because I wanted to make sure he wasn't covered. Third and goal from the eight. What's Fryer doing here? Nope. Nope. See the back of the end zone. Oh, somebody move. 
Somebody move Hudson Bonani for the touchdown. His first, no, his second career rushing touchdown. They said first. I think it's first of the day. Hudson Bonani, not a great runner. He'll take it into the end zone there. And the 49ers will capitalize on the turnover. I was worried he was going to fumble it when I dove for it. We saw what happened with, I believe it was Cleveland, either early in the season or preseason. Joel Edison will make this extra point. And the 49ers will have a 20-13 lead, 18 seconds to go. Believe the 49ers are getting the ball back in the second half as well. All right. 20-13. 49ers just going to play it safe a little bit here. Honestly, you can just... Take the, the secondary off. Give some cushion there. Going to be a handoff to Payne up the middle. Trying to get fancy with the juke. It really wasn't needed. Cowboys going to call a timeout probably just to run the ball again. Seen this happen a whole lot. I don't know. They might try to air it down the field. Again, our two-minute drill defense, not the best. Thomason over the middle has Terrence Williams down to the 49. Seven seconds to go time to work with here they do have one timeout left they're gonna have to get a quick playoff and call a timeout if they'd like to get the field goal out of it it's certainly possible they don't have a lot of time to do this though a quick dump off to Williams he's not gonna hold on to it two seconds to go they are in range of a Hail Mary though they are in range in fact it almost be better for the 49ers if he had caught that pass Instead, the Cowboys will get one more play out of it. Thomason looking to throw, and that's coming up way short. Oh, I wanted the interception. We're going into halftime. 20 to 13, the 49ers with the lead over the Cowboys. All right. I'm in pain because you don't care. Who doesn't care? What? 49ers, pretty good first half overall. And they will receive the ball to begin the second half. Pink's mad at me? Wait, what BYD? First and ten. Oh, Lucina didn't get the block in time. Hey, what up, Polyander? How you doing today, man? Good to see you, sir. Because I beat the Bills. Yeah, week one. Oh, that's, that's trouble. Woo! Covering a lot of ground, Jalen Smith. Dang. BYD, I said something to you a little bit ago. I don't think you were here. The ref in this game got in the way of my player. And I was like, I told you refs were paid off. On the left side. Oh, Kirkland Marion had an open field in front of him. Holly Ander, thank you for the whole sneaky nation. Can we get a shout out for Holly Ander? He is streaming as well, guys. Go show some love. Check out his channel. Give him a chance. I'm sure you're going to love his stream. Sharp barely getting that kick off. Moten is a dangerous returner. He'll be taken down at the 33. How did you get them no name players? We're in year five. I've been drafting people. I'm in franchise mode. You go through franchise mode at the end of the season, you, you add people. My stream is basically me getting hammered for three hours. I love it. And that reminds me, I do owe y'all a shot from the Wheel of Doom. I, I'm going to forget about it if I don't go grab a glass for it now. I'm going to do that because I already forgot about it twice, I think. I should have grabbed it last time. Let me go get this drink. I'll be right back.
the chair though. All right. Everyone here hanging out with me. All the new viewers, all the subs. Just people chilling. Cheers, guys. Woo. Let's go. Isaac. Thank you for that follow, man. Welcome to Sneaky Nation. How you doing tonight? Pressure coming. He'll throw the ball away. Yo, take it easy, Jamie. Thank you for hanging out tonight, man. Hope you have a good one, dude. Third down and ten. Uh, straight, Hollyander. Shotgun formation. Thomason over on the right side to Zachary Otto. Down to the 49. <clears throat> Zachary Otto having himself a good game. Don't cry for what? Uh, we'll see, Hollyander. We'll see how much hype chat's bringing and everything. Play action. Thomason scanning the field down the left side. Once again, it's Zachary Otto getting behind the defense there. All the way to the 27. And the Cowboys coming out on the second half looking good. You can't do fireball straight up too much cinnamon. Throw it inside a beer. Really? I've had it with uh, cider a lot. But I do have a cider downstairs, actually. It was given to me a long time ago. I'm sure it's still good, though. Let's see. Do you draft so much? So can I give you some tips? Um, I typically try to scout the first rating of every position I need. If they have a B plus or higher, I definitely scout everything else they have. If they have a B or higher after that, I will typically. Um, it's pretty. What, what questions do you have? Third down and seven. Pressure coming. And that's a sack for Tajay Veal, his second of the game. He is killing it, doing the George Jefferson walk. And the Cowboys going to lose a lot of yards there. It'll be fourth and 15, setting up for about 49-yard field goal. And Bailey is going to knock this through the uprights. 20-16 to 16 is the score. Um... Pretty solid scouting strat. Well, I'm trying to wonder what he's wondering because that's just kind of how I do it, and it works out. I typically have so many scout points I can kind of scout most anything I could remotely need. Burton on the return, and he'll take it up to the 25-yard line. Um, what are you scouting with, Isaac? Because you should be able to get better players. Uh, yeah, Hollyander, I'd say so. Oh, the blitz coming. Gregory getting the sack on Hudson Bonani, a nine-yard loss. Yeah, I think scouting's too easy this Madden, honestly. Oh, my gosh. I don't have time to do anything. I actually have not, Hollyander. I was not a big baseball fan growing up. Todman holding on to the pass at the 38-yard line in double coverage. A bullet thrown by Hudson Bonani. And Todman will come down with it. Perfect pass by Hudson Bonani there, where only Todman could get to it. And he'll hold on to the ball in traffic. What up, Rook and Crow? How you doing, man? Rook and Crow, you missed the craziest ending I might have ever had in Madden, dude. And there goes Kirkland Mary in the 35. The 10. A 5 touchdown for the 49ers. Kirkland Marion breaking off a big 62-yard run. And that'll make it a two-possession game. 
Woo! Let's go! All right. If somebody could show, yeah. Rookie and Crow, click that link. You'll see the ending of the last game. Look at the time. Kirkland Marion with a killer run. 49ers on top, 27 to 16. Moten on the return. This guy is dangerous in the return game. We'll take it to the 23. Four out. Otto's there too. Nobody in the backfield. We've seen the Cowboys do this a lot, and it typically works out in their favor, but sometimes they don't get the blocking they need. And it forces Thomason to either throw it away or take a sack. He'll throw it quickly to Otto here, continuing his outstanding game with a 12-yard reception to the 35-yard line. He had eight catches for 84 yards and a touchdown last week. That's only four catches today. I feel like it's been more than that. Probably not vegetarian. That would be weird. Hand off the pain on the right side. Put the juke on Sean Kendall. An 11 yard run for pain there up to the 46 yard line. He's having himself a pretty solid game. 4.3 yards to carry. Nice, Oleander. I love King Griffey Jr., man. First and 10. Thomason on the right side, dumps it off to Williams, and Williams breaking some tackles there. We'll take it to the 44. Hey, no worries, Rook. I understand, man. Got to take care of what you got to take care of. Second down and in inches. Pain in the backfield. It will be a handoff to Payne. He has the first down to Marcus Avery on the stop there. Oh, don't say that, Craig. Why you gotta hurt my heart, man? No faith, dude. <laughs> Hand off the pain up the middle. Has a block ahead of him. A penalty flag is down. This might be coming back. It was a late holding if it was one. This is coming back. And a missed opportunity for the Cowboys there. That is bringing them back a good ways. All the way to the 49-yard line. That is a monster of a penalty. And again, pretty late in the run there for the Cowboys, too. Going to be a handoff to Payne up the middle again. Hit by Forsey at the 43-yard line. A gain of about 9 yards, though. Payne continuing to have an outstanding game here. That's true, Craig. That's true. Holly Ander, you should, dude. It's a lot of fun playing franchise mode. Terrence Williams on the reception. That'll make it a third and short for the Cowboys after being backed up 20 yards there. I don't think we have played the Finns yet. 12 and 4. Nice. And another handoff. Here goes Payne again down the left side. Another big run. 20 carries, 99 yards for Payne. Absolutely killing it behind this offensive line. Even with no Ezekiel Elliott, the Cowboys finding a way to run the ball effectively. Three wide receivers out, Otto at tight end. Vernon in the backfield. It's going to be a handoff to Vernon. And again, Cowboys offensive line smoking the 49ers defense right now. First and goal from the four. I don't think we have struggled to defend the run this poorly all season long. Going to be a handoff to Payne on the left side. He is taken down by Clemens. Going to be second and goal from the three. Okay, get more pressure there. Second and goal. It's going to be another handoff to Payne met by a plethora of 49ers this time. That's the dream, Isaac. That's the dream. Third and goal. From the four. 
Cowboys, four out. Payne in the backfield. They're looking to throw it. Cody getting pressure quickly, though. That'll force them to throw it out of the back of the end zone. That'll set up a fourth down and goal. Cowboys really don't want to come away from this with the field goal, but at the same time, it'll make it a one-possession game again. Dan Bailey will kick it through the uprights. 27-19 is the score, an eight-point game. So if the Cowboys can get a touchdown on the two-point conversion, they'll have a tie game. But first, they have to slow down this 49ers offense. Um, we're gonna tr We've tried to do it before, Holly Ander, and nobody stays active. And then when people are not active, everybody else fusses at me. And it gets tough because I cannot make people play their games. And when I have people yelling at me that certain people are not playing their games, it kind of puts me in a lose-lose situation. But I'm going to try it again this Madden. I'm going to try it again this upcoming, uh, for Madden 18, we're going to try to do a subscriber franchise where every subscriber gets a team. And hopefully we'll just... Hopefully we'll get active people this time. I'd love to. I think it'd be so much fun. But... It's tough because I cannot force people to play their games. So I'd love to try it again. We'll try it again and we'll see how it goes. Second down and seven. We've entered the fourth. Over the middle, Dimitri Todman with the catch to the 37. I would do a um, PS4 one and an Xbox one. I don't want Xbox subscribers to play too. We'll, we try to do one on each, but I would need help from certain mods. I would need my mods to step in and, and really help me do it because I I don't have time to do it all, man. It's tough. We just had a few different people helping out. It'd be awesome. Second down and eight. Oh, on the right side, Mooney unable to hold on to it. Going to be third down and eight for the 49ers. Cowboys might have a chance to get the ball back here. I play PS4 because I'm human, right? PS4 is so much better. And Todman holding on to the ball. This might be coming back. On a very costly holding penalty. Oh, come on. Oh, on defense. There we go. It doesn't matter. Dimitri Todman will deliver the first down to the 45-yard line. I appreciate that, Bama. Bama did do a killer job helping me out with it, too. Bama knows how difficult it is getting everybody to play their games. Second down and eight. But yeah, I'd love to try again, man. I'd love to actually make it work. I think it would be a blast. Oh, a high pass to Cleveland. That was not a good throw by Hudson Bonani. Cleveland had an easy catch. Would have been close to a first. He probably would have been a yard or two shot. But then we have third and one or third or two. Not third and eight. Not a good throw. Oh. Dang, I was trying to throw that to Fryer. Not a good throw, though. Fourth and eight. I don't... Oh, they want me to go for it. Do I have the wind at my back? Oh, with a great kick. The wind is at my back here. I don't think that's good enough. Oh, it is Joel Edison with the 60-yard field goal. Wow, making it a two-possession game. Call, wait, what call? Oh, yeah. <laughs> what a kick by Joel Edison. I'd appreciate that, Holly. And a good night, bro. Take it easy, man. Hope you get a good night's sleep. And he missed the 20-yarder gimme last week, right? 
First and 10 from the 25. Thomason looking to throw. Buckner coming with pressure. He'll barely get the ball out of his hands there. Second down and 10. Play action. Thomason scanning the field under pressure. Marcel Cody with the sack. Oh, that's Armstead. I take it back. Armstead with the sack, forcing the fumble. The Cowboys will recover, though. Third and 19. <coughs> Here we go. Ah, Clippers, we all love you, bro. Thank you so much for the always kind words, dude. Marcus, guests are breaking it up. Throw some love to Clippers in the chat, dude. Great play by Marcus Gesser there. 11-11 on the clock. Everybody make a wish. Thank you, Clippers. Let's see. Very true, Hollyanna. That's a good quote, man. And Sellers. Not much of a return there. Flag is down. I don't know what this flag could be. I missed that one. All right. First down and 10. And Siante Cherry on the right side have, has had kind of a quiet game for him, adjusting and learning how to play with Dimitri Todman. Second down and two. Hand off to Kirkland Berry and nothing there. Good play by Jones. The third down and three. Third down and three from the 42. Oh, pressure coming, Dimitri Todman with the catch. Down to the 36. Dimitri Todman having himself an outstanding game, returning from injury. Seven catches, 91 yards. Hand off to Marion up the middle. I'm going to take it for a gain of three. Second down and seven for the 49ers. And that's going to be Todman with another catch down to the 21 yard line. 49ers offense is on the move again. Dimitri Todman is eighth catch of the day going over 100 yards now. And Todman once more on the right side going for the end zone shy at the one. Hudson Bonani leading this team down the field. It'll be first down and goal. And Bonani rolling out, throwing it away. Yeah, Tommen, this is his first game back. Oh, I don't like that. <laughs> Quick throw to Cleveland into the end zone. Touchdown for the 49ers. Darion Cleveland, the rookie tight end with the reception. Quick throw by Hudson Bonani. Tom and doing well, but he'll have to block a kick if he wants the contract. <laughs> oh, let's see. Yo, Wiganator, take it easy, man. Hope you have a great night, dude. Thank you so much for hanging out this evening, man. And I hope you get a great night's sleep, dude. Joel Edison through the uprights. 
37 to 19 49ers having themselves a killer start to this season right now cherry for rookie of the year i mean we've got three guys who have got to be at the top of the list for rookie of the year hudson bonani siante cherry and darion cleveland they're all absolutely killing it Obviously, Hudson Bonani had that one terrible game, but other than that one game, he has been fantastic. Thomason on the right side to Ono Gayton, former 49er. Seven-yard gain to the 32-yard line. Who do I think has been our rookie of the year so far? Probably Cherry. Cherry goes for bigger plays, but Cleveland's very reliable and gets a lot of those short to medium gains as well. Thomason looking to throw it. Under pressure, he will throw it away. All right. If we get one more sub, from here to the end of this game, we'll play another week. How about for each new sub, I'll just play another week tonight. And we'll just keep going until I don't get it. <laughs> and if I don't anyway, that's okay too. We'll stream tomorrow. First and 10 for the Cowboys. Time ticking away on them, though. Keith is on the field. I always like that. Thomason looking to throw over the middle. Overthrown there. What up, Decal? How you doing today, man? Good to see you, sir. Second down of 10. How close to the new emote? Six sub points away from a new emote. Second down and 10. Thomason shotgun under pressure on the right side. That's pain with the reception. Been a little bit more quiet here in the second half, but obviously the Cowboys are kind of forced to throw it a bit more. So we're not seeing them run it all over our defense anymore. Third down and one. Thomason on the left side to Des Bryant with the catch, a 10 yard reception. Didn't count? What do you mean didn't count? Oh, to ours? Really? I would have thought it would be. First down and 10. Thomason looking to throw. Under pressure, he is going down. Tajay Veal again. His third sack of the day. Having a monster game. He's second down and 19. Yes, we have gotten quite a few new followers tonight. So all the new followers, again, welcome to Sneaky Nation, guys. Thank you all for those follows. Hope you guys enjoy the community and the stream. Over the middle, Tajay Sharp down to the 33. Tajay Sharp's been bouncing around the league a little bit, but now with the Cowboys, the best team he's been on yet, I would say. Third and three, we're going to send a blitz. Oh, really, Craig? Didn't even know that, man. Thomason looking to throw. Under pressure has Tajay Sharp. That is good for a five-yard gain and a Cowboy first down. I Fuzzy Trials help. Thank you for that follow, man. Welcome to Sneaky Nation, dude. Hope you are having a good night, sir. First down and 10. Thomason looking for a quick throw. See more butts. Thank you for the follow, dude. Welcome to Sneaky Nation. Hope you're having a swell evening, sir. Or madam. I don't assume your gender. I only need asparagus. That's another nice one. Follows coming in, man. Welcome, guys. Welcome. Thank y'all. I only eat asparagus. <laughs> what a killer name. <laughs> Thank you for that follow, man. Welcome to Sneaky Nation. Here we go. Second down and four. Shotgun formation. Thomason dumps it off to Bryant. Good for another first down. But Des Bryant is down on the field. 9,500 follows. Unreal. Thank you guys so much. Coop17 with the follow. Sneaky Nation rising up with that follow train. Man, you guys keep it up. I might just stream another one anyway, even without the sub. Thank you guys so much. Tajay Sharp out at the one. Cowboys offense is on the move. 
It's the name Tim gave me. It's vegetarian. <laughs> oh, gosh. What a vegetarian, you pleb. You ploob. First and goal. Looking a quick throw. It's a fumble. And Strickland will pick it up. The rookie middle linebacker is taking this to the house. The 30, 25, 20, 15, 10, 5. Touchdown, 49ers. Strickland, though, filling in for the injury to Navarro Bowman. Coming up big. What a play. Tajay Beal, his fourth sack. Dude, our defense, man. Our defense. It's too good. Our defense is freaking too good. Strickland, let's go! Dude, we drafted him in, what, the 6th or 7th round? Just for depth? Well, the Navarro Bowman injury kind of forcing him into a different role. And he's doing well. When the, Oh, gosh! Another blocked extra point, though! Wilcox, again, picking it up. Asher McClover, the only one with the chance to chase him down. And the Cowboys... Did he get it? Decal! Thank you for those bits! Wait, did he get them? They got the two points. That was close. Did they get the two points? I forget how many they had. They stopped them, I think, actually, right? They had 19. I think McClover stopped them. I forget. I, only, I forget how many points they had, I guess. No, they didn't get it. Okay, we stopped them. I thought so. McClover with the tackle. The clutch tackle. That a boy, McClover. Asher McClover's got some speed to him. I think he's 87 speed. Tajay Sharp taken down there. Asher the Dasher. That's a good one. I like it. Makes sense for him, too. Yeah, McClover has 87 speed. Thompson looking to throw. Any, but any other quarterback, we're screwed there. Plenty of time to work with. Has Ono Gaten again to the 44-yard line. And again, 49ers defense really not looking good right now in this uh, two-minute drill defense. They typically struggle here. Thompson looking to throw. Plenty of time to work with, and Tajay Sharp another grab. They are targeting AJ Stump right now by the looks of things, and it is working out for them. We're going to go to a zone defense because our man defense not covering anything right now. Thomason looking to throw. Time to work with again. Dumped off the pain. He is unable to hold on to the ball. Tried running up the field before the catch was made. Going to be second down and 10. Philip Clemens is underperformed. He's been all right. I mean, there's really only so much he can do. Our team's getting a ton of sacks anyway. It's typically Veal, the one blitzing, and uh, Clemens more often than not, you know, in coverage or something else. He does blitz from time to time, but like here he would. But again, you got Tajay Veal and DeForest Buckner on the line. They're the ones that are making the plays, and you just saw Clemens get double teamed there. Another catch for the Cowboys, making it look easy at the moment. But they got down here last time, and the 49ers ended up coming away with the points. Shotgun formation. Thomason looking to throw. Under pressure on the left side. Moulton with the catch down to the eight. About a three-yard gain there. When is the last time this defense has gotten an interception, though? feel like it has been a good while. Second down at six. Another false start here. June Cab, thank you for the follow, man. Welcome to Sneaky Nation, dude. All right. Second and 11 from the 13-yard line. They can get a first down here. 
Going to be shotgun for Thomason. Under pressure on the left side. Has pain. But really not doing a lot there. Maybe a two-yard pickup. It'll be third down and ten. I'm going to try sending a safety blitz here. We'll see if it works. Thomason looking to throw. Penalty flag down. Oh, no. Gaten with a touchdown. Marcus Gesser could have swatted that away. Not the best coverage there. What is this penalty, though? It is coming back. Holding on Jordan Boyle. That's going to make it third down and 20 from the 21-yard line. See if this defense can get a stop here. Shotgun Thomason looking to throw. Under pressure, down the right side, and excellent coverage from Chantro Wilkerson and Sean Kendall. Terrence Williams unable to come down with it. Fourth and 28 seconds to go. The Cowboys are going for the touchdown. Will they get it? They do have pain in the backfield here. And the Hail Mary is thrown up, and Browning is coming down with the interception for the 49ers. They will take over with four seconds to go. Teddy Browning making his impact known here. Are the Cowboys really going to call a timeout if I kneel this one? Burn with the 500 bits. Sneaky Nation. I said if we got one more sub, I would continue the stream. We didn't get the sub, but Fern just donated 500 bits. So we are going to make it happen anyway. Can y'all throw some love to Fern? Because the stream shall live on. We'll play one more. We'll play another. The 49ers with another victory. Their defense is so freaking good right now. Teams are struggling to get the ball into the end zone. 43 to 19 is the score. Unreal. Unreal. Good night, Craig. Take it easy, man. Hope you get a great night's sleep, dude. Thank you so much for hanging out with us this evening. All right. Here we go. Malcolm Thomason. Foot bungus. Thank you for that follow, man. Welcome to Sneaky Nation. 33 of 53, 391 yards, 62% completion, one touchdown, one interception. Hudson Bonani rebounding from a terrible five interception game last week. 114.2 quarterback rating, 21 of 32, 281 yards, 65% completion, two touchdowns, zero interceptions. Running the ball, Joe Payne. 22 carries, 99 yards, 4.5 yards a carry. Kirkland Marion, 16 carries, 120 yards, a touchdown to go with a 62-yard run. He did fumble the ball once. Joey Vernon, the rookie out of Stanford, 3 carries, 25 yards for him. Hudson Bonani, 2 for 7 and a touchdown. Carlos Hyde, 1 carry, 1 yard and a touchdown. Dimitri Todman, in his return to the team, 9 catches, 123 yards, 0 touchdowns though. Terrence Williams, 7 for 69. Tajay Sharp, 7 for 67. And Des Bryant, 6 for 85 and a touchdown. Darion Cleveland, 6 for 59 and a touchdown. Zachary Odo, 4 for 76. Joe Payne, 3 for 16. And Siante Cherry, only three catches today. He did get 81 yards and a touchdown. And then Ono Gaten, the former 49er, three catches, 40 yards for him. Defensively, oh my gosh. Poor right tackle, DeMarco Wilhoyt. We saw that he wasn't the highest overall. He gave up three sacks on the day. Then the right guard gave up one sack. The left side of the line did a pretty good job, though. John Forsey, 16 total tackles, 12 for stump. One of the only games we've seen the defense on the field more than the offense for the 49ers, I feel like. Four sacks by Tajay Veal against that young right tackle. Eric Armstead with the sack. Gregory with the sack. And Soma Blackshear. With a sack, the rookie out of Kentucky. Teddy, uh, Teddy Browning, the interception at the end of the game there. Fumbles forced two by Tajay Beal. One by Eric Armstead. One by Marcus McLaughlin. Fumbles recovered. Maxi Strickland, the rookie 
out of Pittsburgh. Late round pick. I think we got him in the sixth round, if I'm not mistaken. Two fumbles recovered in his only game. Well, his only game was significant playing time. And a touchdown. There we go. Kicking. Dan Bailey 4-4. Four four, but Joel Edison, 4 of 6 in extra points. Unreal. Two extra points blocked. Kick returns. Long of 30 for Burton. And then punt returns. Kirkland Moten a long of 7. That'll be it for the game. 49ers escape with a victory and remain undefeated on the season.